Hi there, this is Molly Papp. Welcome back to my channel, Bella Vita Therapy. Thank you so much for joining me. Sorry it's been a while. I just want to do a quick video during the holidays about how to get your needs met in a relationship. I know this can be kind of frustrating because we expect our partners to just, you know, listen to us and pay attention and maybe do what we'd like because we've, you know, sent them signals either verbally or, you know, through nonverbal ways, but unfortunately that's just not how it works. Sometimes we have to be quite explicit about what we need in a relationship and even what we need in the bedroom. So my number one thing I want to share with you guys today is that we have to do what we'd like for our partners. Now, not everyone's love language is the same. So if your partner loves giving you gifts, but they're not a person who likes receiving gifts, then you giving them all these gifts isn't really going to translate. But say you want more verbal affirmations from your partner, you never hear you're beautiful or thank you so much for paying the bill on time or whatever. So try using that to flip the script on them. So next time you find that, you know, they do something really nice for you, show them that verbally. And over time, you'll see how they pick up on that. And if it's still not working, be more explicit in telling them, I need you to tell me this and point it out in the moment. If you spend a really long time making dinner and they don't even say thank you, say, hey, you know, I spent a really long time making dinner. Do you like it? It'd be really nice if I could just hear that maybe it tasted good. Um, and your partners may get defensive, to be honest with you, but it's better than just being frustrated and not being able to communicate. And this goes the same way in the bedroom too. If you're upset about not getting what you want sexually, you need to share, you need to tell them, you know, this is how I like it. Uh, and if that's, you know, awkward, then, you know, maybe there's a bigger problem because if this is a person who's literally, you know, going to be inside you or vice versa, and you can't tell them how you like something, then why are you having sex with them? You know what I mean? It's something that begs a, a, a different question. So I just want to empower you guys to know that it's okay to say what we want or to say what we don't want. And I would also encourage you to not do something for our partners that you hate doing just to make them happy. Now, of course, everyone compromises and there's things that aren't our favorite, et cetera, especially sexually. But if it's something that you like really don't want to do, then don't do it because you'll do it and then you'll secretly resent them for making you do it. So anyways, just a couple of tips to help you, you know, hopefully improve your relationship and know that it's okay to say what you want and say what you need, always with kindness and love because this is your partner, not a random person. Um, and hopefully your relationship will just get better. Thanks so much and have a great holiday. Bye.